Right, next up uh, we have the uh, M&A people. Okay, well M&A rumours and movers today, it's not more of a sort of a, of a fact rather than a rumour. Uh, Anta Fagasta, uh, ticker ANTO in London, um, the Serbian owned Chilean copper mine. Um, £5.55 and a half, down 4.31%. Why? Because oddly to, to most people's minds, they've decided to buy a 50% stake in a Chilean copper mine for around a billion dollars. It's the Zaldivar mine that's owned by Barrick Gold, has around 2.5 million tonnes of proven reserves. It's got a 14 year lifespan. But look, copper prices down 15.4% year to date. Um, Bank of America Merrill Lynch value the whole of Zaldivar at just $1.3 billion. And so, you know, like most people I've, I've spoken to or read, read about this today, uh, they believe that Antofagasta will be overpaying. Um, interesting to note that Antofagasta itself lowered its own full year copper production guidance recently due to delays at, in commissioning a, a mine in Papua New Guinea. Um, so uh, one wonders why they're buying uh, at this particular point in the cycle. The only thing I c would say is if you look at the, the, the ratio of the, of the Antofagasta share price to uh, copper, they are at historical lows, or that ratio is at historical lows, so maybe mm. they think it's the bottom of the cycle, and on that 14 year view, they're getting in cheap, but we shall see. Yes, a bit of a mystery, but at least they're keen in doing something and trying to dig themselves yes. out yes. of trouble, yeah. hopefully at the bottom of the market. Yeah, let's see.